Now let's look at how to simplify ratio. When I have a ratio in part A, okay, 1 and 2 third is to 5 over 6. I need to convert both to improper fraction first. Left hand side, I have 5 over 3. Right hand side, 5 over 6. Now there are two ways. First way, you make both the denominator the same. So I times 2 to the denominator and times 2 to the numerator. So you have 10 is to 5. If you times 6 on both sides, you will get 10 is to 5. Lowest term, you get 2 is to 1. Now the second method is this. I multiply by the LCM of 3 and 6 on both sides of the ratio. So 3 and 6 LCM is 6. So when I times 6 to both sides, I will be able to get rid of the denominator. And I get 10 is to 5. Lowest term, 2 is to 1. How you get 2 is to 1? Divide by 5 and divide by 5 on both sides. Now let's look at part B. In part B, I have decimal. Before you can simplify ratio for decimal, you need to make sure that both sides of the decimal, you get integers. So I have to multiply 100 to both sides of the ratio. Because when you multiply 100, you will be able to get 12 and 56. Both are integers. So I simplify 12 is to 56. Lowest term, you will get 3 is to 14. Now, the third type of ratio that you simplify will be ratio with units. For example 3, the units that you see are seconds and minute. So what you need to do is to convert 1.6 minute to seconds. So you multiply by 60. And you have 96 seconds. Now, I have 600 is to 96. Now please take note that you do not write your units when you write the ratio. So lowest term, you will get 25 is to 4. Okay, I will skip the part on reducing to the lowest term. I'm sure you can do that already.